Back at the house, the finished travertine floor is a hit, and the fresh paint on the walls signals that it's go time for the cabinet install. We are so excited to get the cabinets in. It looks real, like it's starting to look finished, like it's really gonna be a kitchen and not just a crazy blank room. Look at this. Yeah. We have cabinets. Yep. This what looks do you think? really nice. So you guys decided to go with alder. You know, initially we were looking at cherry. And uh -huh. we looked at alder as an alternative. Um, it's a little bit cheaper. and it's Save some bucks. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's got a, a similar grain to it, so. Yeah, it looks really nice. A fast growing tree found primarily on the west coast, red alder is gaining in popularity for reasons other than just smoking fish. It's got a nice grain, it takes stain well, and price-wise, it's hard to beat. The one downside to alder is it tends to be softer than most hardwoods, including cherry, oak, or maple. So we want to be careful not to nick the cabinets during install. All right, so you got the plan? Yeah. yeah. Got it right Let's here. take a look at it. Matt and Melissa were a little leery about taking on the job, but it didn't take much convincing once they learned it was going to save them 800 bucks. We got some work ahead of oh, us. Yeah, this is, yeah, we this is uh, it's a puzzle. It is. Put it all together. It is, but <laughs> we have all the pieces. Coming up, see the tool that will make your custom cabinet install a breeze. It's a cordless plane. Wow, look at that. We bring in a modern vibe with a metal backsplash. And you did this. I did, yeah. Plus, the spending spree continues. But are Matt and Melissa's eyes bigger than their budget? And I have to roll with the punches, and we'll see what happens, I guess. <laughs>